Hey guys, I am Peter Hurley from the Headshot Crew and I am a headshot photographer based here in New York City. Headshots are my thing, I've been doing them forever and I'm gonna give you five tips on how to do them well. Tip number one, shoot that sucker horizontally. Cameras are designed this way. When you look through it, going vertically, it creates all sorts of stuff. You're snugging your person up into a, a little box. Give them air to breathe. They got breathing room, shoot them horizontally. If you want to crop it vertically, you can crop it vertically after. It's easier on you to shoot that way. You can manipulate your camera easier. It's also very important for tip number two coming up next. Tip number two is camera height. It's a huge factor when shooting headshots. Why? If you want to empower people and give them a presence, make them look more heroic, more confident, more powerful, you've got to shoot from a lower camera angle. If I shoot like this, it's kind of cheese factor 257, no? It's kind of silly. A lot of people put cameras way up in the sky because they think their jawline's better. I'm going to give you tip number three. It's going to be jawline. But tip number two, camera angle. Get a little bit lower, give your person presence, have them stand up straight, and it'll make them look like a more powerful individual rather than weak. Number one way to make your human look more attractive is to get their jawline out. So in order to do that, you're gonna stand them up. You're not gonna sit them down and get them all slouchy. You're gonna stand them up. You're actually gonna stand them up as tall as they can be as a human because that's gonna lengthen their jawline and their neck and get everything already in order. And then you're gonna have them jam their forehead toward the camera like you wouldn't believe. So it looks like this from the side. Up very straight, out like this. Very uncomfortable, strange, feels weird, looks good. You tell them that it will make them look way more attractive than if they had a slack jawline. This is tip number three. It is my number one tip for humans, but number three when it comes to overall headshot photography. People get uncomfortable in front of cameras as is human nature. Your job, make them better. How do you make them look more chill? You gotta get them to forget about the camera, number one. Number two is make them squinch their eyes. Squinching is how we convey confidence as humans, so you want them to look confident. Most humans, when we're uncertain, we open our eyes like this. This is strange and unusual. I don't talk to you like this is strange. You want to squinch down those eyes just a little bit, just a little bit. Don't go crazy. Don't go squinty like this, like you, you, like you, they can't see. Just a little tiny hint of a squinch. Check out some of my videos on it, but I trademarked it, so if you use it, you gotta give me some credit, right? Why not? I'll take it. Use it. Get people squinching. Guys, tip number five. If you're not excited about your work, how the heck is the person in front of your camera gonna be? You need to show some levels of excitement. Now, if you ever seen me before, I'm animated, I get very excited, I scream and yell and jump around and do silly things. That may not be you. Your level of excitement might have to go from, you could be a quiet person, mellow, very slow moving. You could just be like, wow, and that's enough. If you do not give positive feedback to your subject, they're not gonna have any clue how well they're doing and they're not gonna get more confident in front of the camera. Our job is to get them to be as confident and as chill as they can as quickly as we can during the session. In order to do that, positive feedback. Tell them they're doing well. Get excited about your work. Good, that's it, thank you, thank you. The hair's looking good now, what's going on? How'd you get it out of your face like that? Good, that's good. I happen to use a word that I scream at the top of my lungs when I see a good shot. Three, two, one, shebang! see a shebang on the screen, I get excited. I'm like, shebang, that's a shebang. A shebang is a characteristic attribute or trait that an image possesses that produces a visceral gut reaction of approval in the artist who upon viewing it for the first time rejoices by yelling, shebang! You look at a picture, you get excited, you say something, you do something. The person responds, guess what? They're having fun, you're having fun, you're getting great pictures. That's the way it works, people. Guys, I hope those help. Get people in front of your camera, that's what it's all about. That's why we have cameras and we take pictures of people. Everybody needs a picture taken of them, go take one. You'll practice, you'll practice your direction, you do your thing. If you wanna find more out about how to take headshots and make a living at it, then you gotta go to headshotcrew.com. Sign up for my free trial. You get a week's worth of videos and stuff with me. Why would you not do that? You get a week full of full access. So I wanna see your work, get on there. And if you wanna follow me on social media, I'm Peter underscore Hurley. And with that, I'm gonna leave with a three, two, one, shebang.